All right, you guys, today we're gonna check out how to make this melting RGB text effect here in Photoshop. From the last tutorial, I made it incorrect, so this is gonna be a fixed version. Let's select the Type tool, type in something. I gotta go with the Akira Expanded Super Bowl font. Press Ctrl T, press Ctrl Shift plus Alt, scale it up. And from here, let's go to the filter, liquify, convert a smart object. Let's select this very first tool here, Forward Warp Tool, and these are my settings. And I'm gonna drag the endings of the letters and make them melt one by one. You also can drag them, make them even more liquid by creating these distortions. Let's click OK. I'm gonna collapse the layer. Let's press Ctrl G on the text layer two or three times to duplicate it. And I'm gonna select the first one, redeem it as text. And I'm gonna go with the second one and double click on. Click on color overlay and change up the colors. Select the color, click OK, click OK. Let's select the second one, color overlay. And let's change it up, click OK. I also gonna right click on these, convert a smart object. This is gonna be the magenta. I gotta do the same thing with this, convert a smart object. This is gonna be orange. Now I gotta select the magenta, press Control T, and I gotta press and hold Control and drag this little square at the bottom on the left side and I'm gonna go to the top square and drag it to the right double click release I'm gonna go with the orange control T press and hold control and I'm gonna drag it to the right there you go you also can do this with a couple of more colors if you want I'm actually gonna add another color control J and I'm gonna make this blue double click color overlay blue click OK and I'm gonna drag it on the bottom control T and rearrange it now let's click on the top text, create a new layer. I'm gonna rename this as brush. And now we're gonna go to the adjustments and select hue saturation. And let's increase the saturation all the way to 100. Now let's click on the brush layer and we're gonna go to the brush and select the mixer brush tool. And the first thing we're gonna need to do is go here and click on clean brush. And also make sure that the load solid color only is unchecked. So right now, as you can see, it's checked. Click on it, and now it's unchecked. Also, the wet load mix and the flow should be on 100%. This one should be on zero. And make sure to check the sample all layers. And now if you go on the text and you paint on it, you can see it is going to look something like this. Now it is working this way because the brush density is not decreased. So let's go to the brush settings. And here you can see the spacing, and we're gonna decrease it to 1%. So let's go back and do this again and check this out. It is mixing up the colors. And I'm thinking to increase the brush and just mess around with it. And that's how you make this RGB melting blurry text effect here in Photoshop. Thanks for watching.